It is, and Carmen, want to share this beautiful sunset tonight on the Connecticut River. Thanks to Neil and Haddam for sending that in. The clouds increasing late on this Sunday ahead of actually some rain, which happy to see after the weekend is over at night and we need any drop we can get. And we certainly do have some falling out there right now. Most of this is moving through the greater New Haven area. The yellow is showing up here on the north side of Guilford as you get up toward uh, North Haven and just on the south side of Wallingford. Maybe even a quick little downpour, which great for the lawns and gardens. And I think most people are happy to see that. Tracking out this little downpour over the next half hour or so, it's headed toward East Haddam around 11 and then Colchester closer to 1115 and maybe Niantic will just get on the edge of this shower closer to about 1120. High temperatures tomorrow only around 80. That's the coolest day in the forecast though because here comes the heat wave. It kicks off on Tuesday peaks on Thursday and we may even keep it going into Friday to make it four days as well. It's still warm out there tonight. 79 in New Haven 80 in Hartford. We're at 73 in Chester and Norwich. Last night was nice and comfortable. Temperatures in some spots actually dipped into the 50s. Won't be the case tonight with the clouds, a few showers turning a little bit more humid. Many of us will spend the night in the 70s. Tomorrow, not much of a temperature rise because of the clouds that will be around. So the high is only about 80, but most of the time it'll be dry. The highest chance for any showers will be in the morning. Then here comes the heat wave on Tuesday. High temperature 92 for day one. Heat wave beginning across inland Connecticut on Tuesday. So we'll show you the timeline here. Five o'clock in the morning, some rain out there, but it doesn't last long. Look at how it dries up by 9, 10 o'clock. Just a lingering shower at the shoreline at that point. I can't rule out another random shower tomorrow afternoon. Certainly, they'll have, we'll have a lot of clouds. Um, but not much rain falling from those clouds through the afternoon tomorrow. Then on Tuesday, we'll have uh, some hazy sunshine. It's hot and humid. And again, a small chance for a shower or thunderstorm Tuesday afternoon. That's actually with a little front that will drop the humidity a little bit for Wednesday. It's still hot on Wednesday, but then the humidity comes right back up in a big way, probably peaking on the last day of the heat wave on Friday. So here are the high temperatures on Wednesday. That might be the one day the shoreline gets knocked back into the upper 80s, but inland Connecticut will be in the low 90s. Thursday is the hottest day, a high temperature of 97 in Hartford, 98 in Windsor Locks, and 94 degrees in Meriden and Waterbury coming up on Thursday. Next front moves in on Friday. That's our next chance for showers and thunderstorms. Very warm and very humid out ahead of that front. It looks like the front may slow down too, so there's a chance for showers and storms next Saturday. Not a washout, but that would be good because it could give us a couple of rounds of rain at the end of the week, and we are really going to need it after such a hot and humid stretch in the week ahead. We'll see you coming up at 11 o'clock with more.